All right, back again, Luke here. And today we've got out the old Panic Custom Control Box Super Gun, and I figured we could put in this game here, Gun Do. So let's pop this on and play some of that. Now this is one of those games that is a little bit uh, rare for the Neo Geo MBS. It's quite challenging to find it at a good price, but we'll let it run through here and we'll do some gameplay on it. There's our intro. So let's pop in a couple of coins here and we'll give Musashi Ganduki a try. So let's uh, start this up here. At the beginning, you can choose between two characters. You have your main character and you have your female character, which you can choose from. Uh, each one has a different level of strength or ability. So we'll just go with our main character here. It doesn't give you a lot of time to choose the character. So uh, here it'll show you how to play the game. There are three main buttons for it. You have a regular shot, you have a jump button, and then you have a kind of bionic commando shot, which is like a grappling hook, which is really cool. The game incorporates some interesting parts of common games that you may be accustomed to, like Ninja Gaiden, and here is the other part, which is very similar to bionic commando, where it allows you to swing from trees and stuff. So. But let's uh, jump in here and give it a shot. This game is probably by far one of my favorite side-scrolling beat-em-ups for the Neo Geo. There aren't a lot of them for the Neo itself, but this is probably one of my favorites. And as I had mentioned at the beginning of the video, it's a little bit challenging to try and find this at a decent price. Um, sometimes it can be extremely expensive, and other times it can just be hard to find. Uh, you, you can be looking for it for a very long time. Um, the difficulty on this game is quite high. There's a lot of respawn with the enemies, and the enemies are very unforgiving, so you have to be quite quick and progress your way through the game as quickly as possible. Here, you, by saving the different girls in the game, you wind up getting some food or different weapons. Some kind of cool secrets, if you may call them that. Got some health. The music and the difficulty of the game make this a really fantastic game to play. The very first time you play it, don't be surprised if you find yourself dying quite a lot. Because it does take some getting used to. With the different enemies here too, you'll notice the different colors, they take different hits, so... But yeah, standing in one spot and continuously just trying to shoot uh, an enemy... ...will just lead to your own death here. Gotta watch out for the animals or the birds and stuff as well in the game because everything is out to kill you. We're coming up on our first boss here, and we don't have a whole lot of health, so we might wind up dying at this one. Each time you come up to a boss battle, you'll hear this music. It's very common. And it'll go back and forth with dialogue between you and the boss. 
And if you want to, you can just let it go through a natural speed like it is right now. If you want to skip through it, you can press the A button to make it go faster. Uh, unfortunately, if you die at any of these boss battles, you have to go through the same scenario each time. Uh, by pressing the A button, though, you can go through it much, much quicker. So... This boss is a bit challenging. All the bosses have a special kind of pattern that you have to learn, but we'll see what we can do with this one. And here we go. Slide. Nope. Okay, kind of got trapped in the corner there. <laughs> Let's try this one more time and see if we can do a little bit better here. So in order to slide here, try and get through this. So pressing A as quickly as possible, and you can get through it much faster. But. Second part here. Kind of sloppy, but we made it through the first stage here. At the end of the stage, it'll tell you how many people you rescued. You'll see the girls in the middle there. Those are the ones that you've saved. And on to the next stage. This stage here is one of my favorites. I really like the music and the graphics to this one. One thing that's a little bit kind of too much in this stage is the sound effects for the water. They can be quite intense and uh, it can kind of overtake the rest of the um, sound effects. I'll let you probably see it here in a little bit. But this is one of those games that the more times you play it, the better it gets. Here's the, uh, the waterfowl sound effects. Watch out for some of the walls here. There are some power-up items that you just don't want to get. Uh, some of the power-up items will, like this one, not one of my favorites. And it's very difficult to use. Should have slid there, here. And the weapon upgrades, they'll last for a limited time only. You can see here, I walked too far into that one. But this is where the kind of noise is just a little bit too much for the waterfall. Just a fantastic, well-rounded game. Like I said, there's a lot of challenge to it, and you'll find yourself maybe dying the first couple of times that you play it, but I think that also goes with most Neo Geo games here. Get to 
do our kind of swinging. And this takes a, a bit of time to get used to here. You have to get really good with the control of this. Yeah, a bit tricky. There we go. That's not one that I want. Once again, you can see it's it's got its tricky parts and difficult parts. We're coming up on our second boss. Just try and skip through this a little bit faster so you guys can get a little bit more of a look at the game here. Just want to show you guys a little bit of what Ganyuki looks like here. Musashi Ganyuki for the Neo Geo MBS. It's a fantastic game, very challenging, and it's a quite difficult game to find for a decent price. But if you get a chance to come across it, it's definitely one that needs to be in your MBS collection. But that's about all for me for right now. Like always, I'll put up another video here soon. So thanks for watching. gonna do it here. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys.